My name is Garrett Bray. I'm from Perth, Western Australia. My name is Komfota Makiaita. I'm from Ghana. My name is Theophilos Sotiropoulos Mihalakakos, and I'm Greek Canadian. I'm studying a Master's in Engineering for Sustainable Development, and my research has focused on optimising a future of shared autonomous electric vehicles. The future of mobility is changing, and this could have a lot of positive implications, but it could also have negative implications around congestion, job losses, and how we use our urban space. So to address this question, I have developed a framework and quantitative model which enables scenario generation for cities and then taken that work to Silicon Valley to test it with industry experts. This is the framework that I've developed and I've applied this along with a quantitative model to the city of Cambridge as a case study. And that flows using the quantitative model into operational metrics such as vehicle miles travelled, economic metrics such as impact on household budgets, social metrics such as impact on congestion, and environmental metrics such as impact on air quality. So mobility affects everyone and the potential impacts of a future of shared autonomous electric vehicles could be huge. I really wanted to be involved in accelerating that future and I've developed this piece of work to help city authorities and private fleet operators optimise for the best outcomes. I've been focusing on plastic waste management in urban Ghana. I was born and raised in Ghana and for the past 25 years I have seen how plastic waste have littered our streets, clogged our drainage systems and polluted the water bodies and the beaches especially. I felt that for the three months I had to tackle a project, it was going to be a worthy cause to find a technique that could manage polythene waste. Polythene waste make up 50% of the plastic in urban waste streams and you, are, you usually find them in sachets from packaged water, shopping bags and a few other light plastics. My goal was to develop an assessment framework using criteria that I drew from sustainability and secular economy literature and I grouped these under economic, environmental and social categories. With these, I assessed seven viable techniques and approaches that I found. Waste management is largely dependent on social participation. I therefore try to measure the perceptions of people about certain waste management policies and I use my findings to enhance my final conclusions and recommendations. So for my project, I'm looking into the decision-making metrics that are used by the government and the investment community in order to rank different energy technology options in order of performance. So I picked this project because I'm interested in renewable energy technologies. I think climate change is an issue that requires immediate action and the methodology used by governments and private industry needs to be thorough enough to ensure that we pick the correct pathway or solution the first time as we will not get a second chance to tackle this. So the six different technologies I'm looking at are solar, PV, um, onshore and offshore wind, nuclear, carbon capture and storage coal, and combined cycle gas turbines. So the primary aims of my project are to develop stochastic models that measure the performance of different electricity generation technologies and also compare those technologies across a suite of different performance metrics that take into account economic cost, systems cost, emissions reduction, and energy efficiency. The Masters in Engineering for Sustainable Development has been great because people that you work with are very inspirational and come from uh, all, all corners of the globe. In the past year, this course has revolutionized my way of thinking and I feel more confident to design solutions that are meaningful to society, environmentally friendly and economically viable for implementation and I recommend it for any other engineer out there.